the three areas we really identified as the primary bottlenecks, at least within the context of Avalanche, are state management, data distribution, and deferred verification. And all of those are really what give it its speed. The first thing, state management. If you can't store and read state extremely fast, you can't keep up with the transaction. So we built our own database from scratch. The second, data distribution. So if you have a lot of transactions, you got to have a lot of data to be distributed to other people to actually validate it and accept it in consensus. The Hyper SDK provides like a P2P primitive for distributing data between the participants. And then the last one is deferred verification. If during the consensus process, you actually have to verify the block end to end, you will really slow down because before any node can actually vote on that new data, it has to actually verify that it's correct. So the Hyper SDK breaks apart everything other than what is minimally required to derive a deterministic result and only does this pre-process step before voting. 